share the stage with you guys today. Because when I started eight years ago, you would have never seen me up in front of the room. I was deathly afraid of public speaking. And so when I saw this, I didn't even know if it was something that I could do. None of the training material existed yet, and I had never done anything like this. But one of my really good mentors, Byron Schrock, um, always said, stop buying your own excuses. He or she that shows the most wins. And that became ingrained in my DNA. And so what I had to learn to do is become a product of the system. And so my first year in the business, I um, had over 1,200 people on my team and I had never personally done a presentation. I mastered one skill and I plugged myself and my team into the system. How many of you, that 1,200 has now turned into over 65,000 all over the world. How many of you would like to know what that skill is? Yeah. Inviting. I became a master inviter. Now, I have a business partner that is phenomenal in front of the room. He understands closing. He has network marketing experience. But I didn't have those skills. And so I had to make up in numbers what I lacked in skill. And so I made sure that I showed up to every single event with at least four or five guests. And so what I'm going to talk to you about today is inviting. Um, there are two key ways of inviting people to share this information. And here's what's important, is that you stick to what you normally do. So let's just say that you, see, I'm a texter. I don't normally call. If, if I were to call someone, they would probably think something was wrong. You know? I just, I'm not a big, I don't pick up the phone a lot. But if you, if that's how you, what you generally do, is that how you generally communicate with your friends? That's what you're going to do. Is you're going to pick up the phone and you're going to invite use, using what's called the four-step invite. Um, how many of you in this room are familiar with the four-step invite? Okay, cool. I'll go over it. Here are the four steps. Step number one is be in a hurry. Step two is clear the date. Step three is I got something important to share with you. And step four is confirm the date and time. Now, I have a disclaimer to make. Because when I first heard that, I was not a big fan. I was super intimidated by the four-step invite. Mm. But here's what you have to understand is that it's there as an outline. Because the last thing that you want to do is set yourself up to start giving a presentation over the phone or to be asked a million questions. And see, once I understood that and I added my personality to it, it was game over. So here's what it looks like. Let's just say I'm calling to invite Terry. Terry's my girlfriend. Terry and I are girls. So I can call her and I can be like, hey, girlfriend, I'm walking into an appointment right now, but what are you doing tomorrow at 7? Okay, cool. See, if I called her and said that, it wouldn't be weird. There wouldn't be that weird energy between us. See, the closing starts with the invite. Because if your friends, like if you call them and you're being weird, they're going to think like, that's what I have to do. I don't want to, like, that's just awkward. Like, I don't want to have to do that to my friends, right? right? And so if I were to call her and do that, it wouldn't, there wouldn't be that awkward energy between us. And so if she's, uh, let's just say you're not available, okay? So if she wasn't available, what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, okay, girlfriend, let's catch up later this week. Love you. And I jump off the phone. Okay, got it? Now, um, she's available, so I'm going to move on to the next step. So I need you to be at my house tomorrow at 7. i got something important to share with you. Okay, okay human nature, they're going to ask, what is it, right? Here's what I would tell her. Girl, I am not going to ruin it for you. Can I count on you being there? Mm -hmm. Awesome. See you tomorrow at 7. Okay? So um, that's what the four step looks like. Very nice. Lisa.